Hey guys, this is Cyril Gupta the Jeet Kai and in this video I am going to show you how you can connect Video Jeet to Facebook and post updates to your Facebook page from it. To do this, you will first need to create an app of your own in Facebook. You will need to register yourself as a developer and then create the app. Let me show you how to create an app in Facebook to get the app ID and the app secret that we'll need for video cheat. So let's start a browser. I'm using Internet Explorer and let's go to developers.facebook.com. So this is the URL you'll need to go to developers.facebook.com. And when you come here for the first time, Facebook might want to make sure that you have a phone number connected to your account that it's verified. So if you don't have a verified phone number, you'll have to verify your phone number. And that's a two minute process. It's not too difficult. Facebook will tell you exactly how to verify the phone number. And when you've done that, you will get a menu similar to this. You will get a page similar to this and there'll be a menu command over here, apps. And in that you'll need to find the button, the command, create a new app. Click on it. And that will let you uh, put in some details. You will need to put in a display name. So give it any name you want. Uh, it can be anything random. It does not need to reflect any particular thing. For example, I'm going to name it something. Whatever you want and you will need to give it a namespace the namespace is your unique app identifier on Facebook it should all be lowercase so I'm gonna give it a namespace alright so this is the namespace then you don't need to create a test version of another app or whatever you can leave it empty you need to choose a category choose any category you want uh, anything you want actually will do and then when you're ready when you have filled in all these details click on create app and you might need to fill in the verification code so do that if it asks you to alright so I always get it wrong in the first try so that's how we get it right this time alright so we got it and now Facebook will display your apps details it will display your app ID this is your unique app ID and also your app secret you can click on show and it might ask you to put in your password again and this is your app secret you will need these two details for enabling the posting to Facebook in video cheat so what creating an app effectively does is it protects you from all the other people who are using video jeet to post updates to your to their facebook pages because all of them are using their own apps so if they make a mistake if they post uh, to facebook too often or if they violate the terms of service in some other manner when if facebook takes action against anybody if facebook bans any apps it will protect all the other users and their updates will not be affected that's why every user needs to create their own app and this is also according to the Facebook TOS to uh, have updates like these you better create your own apps and make sure that uh, the software works with uh, with the with the Facebook TOS alright so you will need the app ID and the app secret which are listed over here if you need to change the app secret at any time you can use the reset button and change it but before we go from uh, Facebook to video Jeet, I want to tell you about one more setting that you need to do go into settings which is on the left side and then go into advanced advanced tab and it might take some seconds to load right and there is a setting over here which says native or desktop app enable if your app is a native or desktop app and you need to enable this because our app is a is a native app and it needs to uh, uh, Facebook needs to know that it's a native app and it will treat it accordingly 
you don't need to touch anything else this is enough just make sure that it's set to yes for native or desktop app and that's all you need to do just click on save changes and that's it your app is correctly set up now go back to dashboard and you will need the app id and the app secret click on show to show it again and now we'll go to video jeet and learn what exactly do we need to do in video jeet to set up facebook access to set up the facebook page posting access and now it's time to connect your newly created app to video jeet and start posting the updates from it to your facebook page to do that first we need to load up video jeet and select the blog that we want to work with that we want to post the updates from so find the blog click on it uh, click on it on the on the sidebar over here and that will display a list of the videos in it but we don't want to go there what we want to do is click on settings scroll down a bit and we'll find a button which says connect fb so click on this button connect fb and video jeet will ask you for the fb app id and the fb secret we'll need to get it from the browser again this is what we had uh, when we created the app let's get the app id by clicking on it and then using Control c come back to video jeet paste it go back to the browser copy the app secret using Control c again bring it to video jeet paste it and click on submit video jeet will now load up facebook where you will need to give your app a few permissions so uh, you will need to give it the permission to post your page and anything that you want to do so click on ok a couple of times you will need to you will want it to post updates to your facebook yes we want to do that and it will also ask you if you want to be able to manage your pages yes we want to let it manage the pages too click on ok and that will give it the permissions it needs and whatever pages you have created in your facebook id will be displayed over here the names will be displayed over here in this particular id which i have created i only have a single page which is called cg it's listed over here if you go into my facebook you can click on uh, uh, my pages so you can see cg is listed over here it's one of my pages in fact it's the only page I have and you can create more pages by clicking on more under pages and then clicking on create a page right now I only have one called CG which is listed over here and I can choose to send my updates to CG by checking it like this by making sure the checkbox is checked and then clicking on submit and that's it the setup of video Jeet and Facebook is done video jeet can now send updates to your facebook page and you can connect one blog to many pages sorry you can connect actually one page to many blogs or one blog to each page whatever setup you want and it will work and let's see how it works so if you if we go to see jeet we'll see that i have a couple of posts already over here which i did earlier for testing so coming back here i'm gonna scroll down find another good post and send it to my facebook page so let's find a good one dead pc diagnosis and repair sounds like a good keyword good video so i'm gonna click on post now and this will post the video to my blog and it will also send the video to my facebook page this typically takes about five to ten seconds the time's already up so let's go back to facebook let's see if we have it right now we don't have it but it should be posted and if we refresh so i'm going to refresh the page if we refresh it should show up right so dead pc diagnosis and repair it has showed up there is a bitly link there is a, a small link to my blog so it will link to my blog too and if somebody clicks on it they'll be taken to the blog post where they'll be able to watch the video and take whatever action you want them to take so this is how the setup of connecting Facebook to Video Jeet worked. It's pretty easy. It's not difficult. I'm sure you won't you won't have any issues doing this if you have seen this video carefully. And if you do have a problem, you can always talk to me on my uh, on my support desk. 
the url is techniforce.com support this is Cyril Chit Gupta signing off have a great day